All right, so I am downloading Iconica, which is our casual library. It includes everything. Here's, here it is. And that's 200 gigs of data recorded by our casual tools. And the uh, strings, goods, brass, and percussion has already been downloaded. And now I'm downloading ensembles. We are going to be composing with no template. It's just in an effort for me to get to know this library and put a few hours behind the library. And then next week, we're going to be creating a very basic template, the typical 25 tracks template. I'm going to load 10. So this is the first one. It is here. You're going to look at options, RAM. That's correct. 4,000 megabytes is the limit. Let's play with this. Let's just start with Viola, Viola Dynamics. So with this library in general, because most of the patches have built-in key switches, I tend to load the dynamics because it generates a fairly small patch. It loads fast and then I get rid of everything and then I load whatever I want. Arp is Bigliando. So this was a viola sustain. This is Arp Beast timpani standard. And I've got the medium mallet. Ooh. It's gonna be maybe Gran Casa. I'm feeling oboe. There are some big patches. This one is almost two gigs of RAM. Sometimes when loading, you get an error. So you gotta go here to options and make sure that max preload is usually set 1200. Let's see that cello. See that Celesta. Timpani hits. Duplicate this one, duplicate track here, it's gonna be ARP. Maybe harmonics? Yeah. So I don't two, and what I want is the trills, semitone. I like this library. Sounds good. Sounds very decent. Sounds great. I'll continue composing. At some point, I'll have 20, 30, 40 tracks. I'll start reusing some of the tracks because I have them there already. I just added a piano here just to sketch this minor harmonic. 
Ah, we're gonna use this quartz. Got diminished this one here. Let's play around with this. Use the solo trumpet. We're gonna compose a little bit more. It's gonna be something completely different because I wanted to test staccato notes and brass that we haven't tried that much. And also I wanted to compose a little bit using key switches. So I basically loaded these tracks. Woods brass strings, horse trumpet trombone, bass trombone, tuba, percussion, 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 and then violin one, two, viola, violoncello, and double basses. We are loading these patches. They're not huge, but they are not very small. They take quite a bit of RAM. And so as you are loading and loading and loading, it took me a little bit to realize because it's different than contact. Contact is gonna tell you how much RAM you are using per instance. But here, even though these are completely separate instances, um, you'll see we are now at 5,000 megabytes and that's the sum of all the instances. Let's go, let's start with cello. <laughs> switch and I'm moving right before this note. this and then I'll move this one here go up and then quantize I'm just gonna articulate a little bit but a little bit more dynamics that's it all right cool Like him. 
This entire thing, 5 gigs of RAM. You can compose pretty fast with uh, with this. We just use the, the staccatos. We also used a little bit of key switching. 30 minutes, just load it and did something like this. That's a plus for this library. Let's start composing. We've got here, up here, sketching patches or fast action patches. With strings and percussion. 200. This one set on this nerve is gonna go here. Cool, all right, and then both of them. This one and this one. Uh, tum tum. The third fader is sustain tremolo. That's what it does. It's a CC2, it's breath control. And then back to four. I like all these libraries that you usually have like a key to sort of like top the release.
sa the thunder. Yeah. Yes. Let's see if this like real so gives us a little bit of that positive emotions, maybe love cute type of sound. Brought down the tempo, so it's hit 75 now. The, the melody in my head does like this. Gonna spend five ten minutes orchestrating this. It's lower in range. It's an octave lower, but that's something like da di dum da dum Here we go. Just a little bit bigger. What we have is dum dum di dum 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 then dim. So one for one in terms of function. Let's see soft horns. to just lower strings. Low register for the flute.
Yes. So the question is, can a computer like this play back what we just did? And the answer is yes, we brought that project in here, we loaded it, we hit play, and the CPU was below 30% all the time. In fact, take a listen by yourself. <laughs> 